It's a terrible day. I'm gonna go on a fast train, but it's always crazy. <laughs> Yep, Lily's right. We are heading out today. We're going to Hiroshima. And it's just like a two hour and 15 minute bullet train from Kyoto. Four minutes to get out of our Airbnb. And we need to hit the road. And it looks like crap out today. It was raining all morning. And I think the rain just let off. Like a seven minute walk to the subway station. And I think it should be a pretty nice walk. And maybe we'll stay dry. I hope so. Okay, we uh, did not miss the rain. It is definitely raining on us. We are at the subway station now, and we just got a little bit wet, not too bad. And we're heading to Kyoto Station to get on the Shinkansen, the bullet train. pitfalls of traveling with kids and strollers is you have to take elevators everywhere. And the subways, it's, oh, it's gone up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. Man, so many elevators and you can never find them. Okay, so we're at Kyoto Station and we're about to get on the bullet train and head to Hiroshima. Obviously not that one because that one's leaving right now, but one just like it. I'll show you the game that I want because it's a really cool game. I watched it on YouTube. People played it. And it has a and it's a cooking game and it has a um, what's it called? A blender. All right, we're on board. Just like two hours. We'll be there. I love this. rolling off the hills. Can't capture it on the camera, but it's it's cool. Passing through these all these little tiny Japanese towns. Love it. Check this out. two bathrooms between all the cars and then they also have like a urinal and you can like just look in the window and see if somebody's in there it's kind of strange but there's a wash sink where you can wash uh your hands brush your teeth do something i don't know but the girls have to go to the bathroom so i thought i'd show you what they look like and here's one of the big bathrooms
Hiroshima right now. <sighs> it was only like an hour and 45 minutes. I don't know why I thought it was like two and a half hours. So pretty easy. It's, uh, it's only like 12.45 right now. We got on. Uh, yeah, we got on at like 11.07. It's 12.45, so. Hey, we made it to Hiroshima. We just got off that train right there. Oh, all right. Let's go see if we can drop our luggage off at our Airbnb and then go find something to eat because I'm starting to get hungry. Added money to my Suka card. So you can add your Suka card to your Apple wallet and um, add money to it that way. But the thing is, we found out that visas, MasterCards, like things like that won't work, but my Amex works to be able to load it. Okay. We are just waiting on the streetcar now. We gotta get on the number six and take it like 14 stops. And it is a rainy day. Can you count that high, Lily? 14. Can because I counted to a thousand. You can't count to a thousand. I mean, I counted to a thousand. <laughs> We're on the streetcar, and we just need to take it 14 stops to, I don't know, close to our Airbnb. And we're at stop one right now, so 13 more to go. Sun's coming out though. It might turn out to be a beautiful day. I'm excited to be here. See what the city has to offer. Yeah, should be fun. Beautiful day. Hey, we're here. We just got to uh, cross this road here. And we just contacted our Airbnb host, said we're gonna drop off our luggage early. And he said, it's actually ready, we can go check in. So it's not even two o'clock yet, and we're gonna get checked in early. So that's freaking awesome. Now, if I can just navigate all these rail tracks to get across the street, that will be amazing. Oh my gosh, it's so freaking beautiful here today. I love this weather. I think it's a lot nicer than it was in Kyoto, too. So we're gonna walk down this path. I think this might be where it's at. We'll find out. A workspace for Daddy? Daddy? Oh my gosh, I never knew that. This is why we wanted to stay here for two weeks, remember? Because it was booked. People complained that the bathroom was downstairs, remember? This is cool. We just made it to Hiroshima. And the weather's beautiful today. It's really overcast, but it feels amazing. And it's a peaceful town. I mean, the part of it we're in anyway. Oh, so I'm just walking around right now because our air tags show our luggage is nearby. So I'm just kind of walking around a little bit and see if I see the Yamato truck nearby our place. And we can get it because I don't think our address has our unit number on it. I think it's just going to be like the block of buildings that we're staying in. So I'd like to catch them because I don't want to go pick up our luggage. I want it delivered to us. So that's what I'm doing right now. All right, 
We got our luggage. That's so awesome. So we just dropped it off at the Yamato office. That was just a block away from our place in Kyoto. And then our luggage shows up here. It's amazing. I love it. <laughs> we don't have to take any luggage on the train or anything. It's great. Okay, we're heading out. We are gonna go to an Okonomiyaki restaurant. Not for Okonomiyaki though. We're going for Yokosaba noodles. Yakasoba, yakasoba noodles. We're going for yakasa, yaka, yoka, yakasoba, yaka. I can't say it. We're going for some noodles. It's gonna be delicious. It's got like a fried egg on top of it. Mmm, looks so good. So hopefully it's open because everything else is closed. Because today's Thanksgiving in Japan. It is Labor Thanksgiving Day, and lots of stuff is closed. So we're hoping everything's open, or this is open. And actually, a lot of stuff's not really closed today because of Thanksgiving. I think it's just closed uh, because it's only 4.30. But we missed lunch today, and we're really hungry. So we're going to go eat right now because I'm hungry. And then we're going to try and get to bed early because tomorrow is Thanksgiving in the U.S. And I think we're going to go try and get some food and maybe make a little, I don't know, American-style Thanksgiving for us. Maybe we'll just go get a rotisserie chicken or something. I don't know. We'll see. Lindsay might have other plans. She'll let you know. I'm gonna drive a Snoopy car. Oh, look, it's cool. So. So. Yeah, let's go. Oh, okay. Come on. Get close. No. Okay, that place is closed until 17.30. Wow, this is beautiful. So we're gonna get a rice ball because I really wanna eat that. This is cool. There's a random bridge crossing the road. Perfectly good crosswalk right down there too. But the girls talked us into taking the bridge over the road. <laughs> Plus, it should be kind of cool up here. The old street cars are really cool. They're, I don't know, neat. <laughs> got like a mix of modern street cars, trams, I don't know what you call them. And then they've also got a mix of like the older ones. And they're so cool. I love them. I'm gonna tell you one thing, though. What? Um, where did the fog set off? Um, maybe we can go there. In this city? Yes. The old taxes are crazy in this country, too. They're everywhere. I think from the 80s. I wonder if they're still making them, or if they've just kept them in immaculate shape for 40 years. <laughs> It's cool, I love it. We haven't ridden one, we haven't ridden in one yet. We just got to the place we're gonna try for Wurtshima style Okonomiyaki. And it's similar to the Okonomiyaki we had in Osaka, I think, but it's got yakisoba noodles on it. And they're making it right now in front of us, and it looks really good. And they've been super friendly here. Uh, so if it's awesome, we'll let you know what place this is because it's cool. We're having a great time. Uh, yeah, just chop this pork right now. Cabbage, noodles, uh, it looks so good. Okay, I got the Hiroshima style Okonomiyaki. And I think we're supposed to put some mayonnaise on it. So. Try it that way first. Yeah. Looks pretty amazing. Mm. Oh. Wow. I've never had anything like that in my life. I can't even talk about it. 
like, I don't know. Such a unique flavor. I can't even identify it. It's good. It's really good. Mm. Really good. I got yakasoba. It looks and smells delicious. <laughs> Are they yummy? Good. That was good. That was real good. And that's the place right there, the red canopy. So go there if you're ever in Hiroshima. So the final tab, 4,000 yen. Yeah, so 4,000 yen for that entire meal. It's like only 27 bucks or something. I don't, I don't know what the exact change rate is right now. That's a steal, man. That's a steal. All right, I love it. People say uh, Japan's so expensive, but Honestly, we have not really seen that to be the case. We just keep saying like, wow, I can't believe how cheap it is here. We were expecting it to be so much more expensive. It's been fun here. Yeah, we've really, really enjoyed our time here in Japan. And it's sad that it's coming to a close. We're in Hiroshima for six days, and then we're gonna take the bullet train back to Tokyo and spend seven or eight days there, I think, so. Essentially, we have like two weeks left, and that's it. And then we're flying to Bangkok, and we don't really have plans yet. Yeah, we're really excited to get back to Thailand, though. Uh, we're gonna try and get to the beaches this time and head up to Chiang Mai. And... I'm just so excited right now. Everything's nice. Happy. We're having a good time. When we hit a thousand, we'll come here, guys. <laughs> when we hit a thousand subscribers, we'll go to that place. <laughs> Hopefully, by the time you watch this video, you're like a thousand. Ah, you guys are at like ten thousand now. That's like crazy. You were only at a thousand subscribers yet. <laughs> we're only at nine hundred and eighty-one right now. <laughs> That's crazy. So, that's it, man. We'll see you later. Love you guys. Bye. <laughs>